Hello guys, welcome to the channel. In this video I will show you how to unlock FSR 3 and frame generation with the game Silent Hill to remake. As you know, this game is quite heavy, but by default you can only enable FS or 1.0. There will be no FSR 3 option in the game settings. This is pretty bad for a game releasing in 2024. I will test it a bit and native 108OP. I only got 27 FPS with the lowest graphics settings. Now try a little with FS or 1.0. FSR 1.0 balanced. Now reaching about 35 FPS, a little better, but that's not enough in 2024. Now exit the game and get to how to unlock FSR 3 and frame generation. There will be some necessary things, I will put the link in the video description. Now open your game folder according to the instructions. Now place the file d3d12.dll there do a backup if your game folder already has this file. Now create a desktop shortcut for the file shproto-win6 for shipping.exe. Open properties from the shortcut you just created. At target, add dash DX12 to the end of the line. Note that there is blank space in front of dash DX12. Then apply. OK. From now on, to unlock the FSR 3 option, you must open the game using the shortcut. More steps are needed to unlock the FPS limit. Open run box and type percent local app data percent. Open Silent Hill 2, saved, config, windows. Search engine.ini. Edit it with notepad or something else up to you. Scroll down to the bottom and add the command line there.
I put it in the video description. It needs to be placed below the last tad's line and needs to be one line apart. Make sure you did it right, then save it. Now let's enter the game. Please remember that you need to start the game through the shortcut created to unlock FSR3. Once in the game, Go to settings and you will see the FSR3 option there. When enable FSR3, frame generation also works. Okay it worked, FPS was boosted.